concert, the fourth in this, our series, Live from St. Mark's. I'm Richard Patterson, the director of the Omni Foundation for the Performing Arts. We'd like to begin this evening's performance with Connor Padmadian, uh, a premier student guitarist. He's 17 years old from the San Francisco Bay Area. Following Connor will be the brilliant, award-winning Chinese virtuoso T.Y. Shang. And uh, we're very happy to have T.Y. with us this evening. Um, later in his program, he will be joined by violinist Strauss Shi. I also want to let you know about our annual raffle, which is going on at the moment. And we have wonderful prizes, amazing prizes, by, provided to us by David Russell, Jason Veal, Alec Holcomb, uh, the Hill Guitar Company, Guitar Salon International, um, Romero Creations, Daddario, Guitar Solo, and many more. Head over to our website, omniconcerts.com, and you can find all the details of the raffle and a complete list of the prizes. Um, try, to, try to join the raffle because it's a fun way to support the series. And remember, these, we are providing these concerts for free, but we rely on your contributions to, uh, to help us keep the music going. So please click that donation button. So please help me welcome Connor to the stage. Uh, this song is based on 
uh, a Hungarian dance, so it has lots of power um, in the piece.
everyone. Um, it's been a long time since that last time uh, anybody sat on a real stage. So really thanks to the Omni Foundation uh, for putting all this effort um, for all of us. And so tonight the program consists of 10 uh, short pieces that I call them my current favorite playlist, like a playlist. And then I'll start with the three Baroque uh, pieces. Mm, the first one is from a less well-known composer, a Portuguese composer, Carlos Seixas, in his keyboard sonata number 24, transcribed for classical guitar. And you can let us know in the comment section who do you think he sounds like?
a truly blessing to be able to play this music、uh, in this instrument. That's、uh, so enjoyable.、Um, uh, okay, so the next piece、uh, is by Domenico Scarlatti. His keyboard sonata K K fifty three. Understood as his music, but、uh, nonetheless, the beauty of this music、uh, is great enough that making us to think this should be a John Dolan piece. But let's hear this、uh, great piece of composition by John Dolan,、uh, a fancy key seventy three.
So now we're going to uh, take a turn. Uh, I'm going to present to you a very modern piece composed by a uh, Brazilian um, contemporary composer Marco, uh, uh, Marco Pereira. <laughs> and this piece is called A uh, Frevo is a form of dance, Brazilian dance. <laughs> emotions out of uh, a human's heart. So it reminds me, particularly uh, in my life's experience, it reminds me of one day, um, it's at night in Los Angeles. Me and my friend uh, drove a car with leftover pizza and a Diet Coke. And then it was a very cold day, and we passed by this uh, intersection, and there was a homeless guy and, uh, with a car that says, uh, any food, so we gave we drove past and stopped, drove back and gave him food. And um, it's a mixed feeling. So you feel uh, like compassion and then you feel sorry and you always feel like how precious that uh, you, 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 you have your life opportunities, what you have, what some people don't have. 
a little sadness and uh, kindness, just mixed feelings, a million feelings go through your heart like movies flash. And then I think all of those emotions uh, can be experienced or expressed uh, in such a piece uh, like this. And I hope you enjoy it. He can cross genre, he can compose, he can arrange. And uh, I think deep, deep inside my mind, there is something that is craving for African elements. And uh, so I instantly fall in love with, with these genres of music. And then this piece is the third movement of his Libre Sonatine, it is called Four Colonies Fire.
next composition is composed uh, as the theme of the movie The Schindler's List. It's composed by film composer John Williams, later transcribed for classical guitar by the guitarist John Williams. And uh, uh, I've made my own modifications and retranscribed it uh, to this version. Um, so what touches me the most uh, of the message from this film and this music is um, uh, I think the beauty of humanity and because towards the end of this film how the Schindler, uh, the industrial German industrial leader who uh, saved 1100 uh, Jewish people uh, from the World War II uh, by his own hand, he buys uh, them uh, to his factory in order to save them. is very, very touching. And he still thinks he hasn't done enough. At the end of the film, uh, he, uh, he cries and talking about, I've wasted so much. Why did I have this car? I could have saved 10 more people. And that really, really uh, uh, touched my soul. And here is the Schindler's list.
So uh, the last solo piece of uh, this program uh, is also by Paul Dance. Mm. I think they capture by the spirit of this mm, piece of music. It is the third movement of uh, one of his the sonata. It's called Trillia, basically it's like three pieces. And this piece uh, is titled Clown Da, uh, inspired by Brazilian music. Uh, has a title Gizmoti in there. And um, so what I listened to, to kind of get me into this um, not so classical way of performing this piece. Uh, so I, uh, I want to share with you one of my favorite artists that inspired me to play this piece, Richard Bona. Uh, Richard and B-O-N-A, and he's like one of the richest musicians uh, I really love, and I really encourage everybody to hear his music and compare to this piece of music.
as program uh, is a duet repertoire by Astor Piazzolla. Um, so this piece is the Night Club 1960 uh, of the set, um, the history of tangos. So now, uh, will we please uh, invite uh, my great friend, uh, the violinist Strauss Shi to the stage. Thank you. So today's program, this piece, um, the little bit history of the tango. Um, during the war, European war, many Europeans uh, would uh, forced to leave their hometown, their country. They would uh, hop on a boat or a big ship, sail all the way to some of them end up in um, South uh, America to Argentina. So what they had with them. Uh, are only musical instruments because they don't share the same currency. So what would they do is they uh, get on shore and play music and have fun with the locals during the daytime. So that's what we have the fast tangle. And then the slow tangle um, is portrayed when they have their downtime. When uh, imagine the sunset and they have this uh, nostalgic moments sitting in a nightclub and thinking about their hometown that they cannot go back to. Um, so here is this very, very interesting piece by Astor Piazzolla, Nightclub 1960. 